I am mindful of the West African proverb that states, when praying, move your feet. <laughs> Which suggests to me our human freedom and indeed our divine mandate to play an active and essential role in our own prayers. It was this proverb and the words of Frederick Douglass when he famously said, I prayed for freedom for 20 years, but received no answer until I prayed with my legs. I thought it appropriate this morning after reading how this very gathering understands the necessity of putting feet to their words by showing up at the state capitol to advocate for policies that care for the poor among us. I thought it appropriate after we sang all those rousing verses of guide my feet. I thought it appropriate after these first 15 months of shocking executive orders and harmful Senate confirmations and irresponsible legislative actions that those of us who profess faith in a God who is reassess how we might pray with our feet as we continue to discern from God how we might walk closer with this God and with one another as we stand against the enticements of racism, heterosexism, xenophobia, gender violence, and capitalism in the face of an administration that appears to have lost their way. <laughs>